I set up Key for Life in 2011. It was at the time of the riots when I saw children as young as eight rioting. So I then decided actually that I was going to put a brand new model together encapsulating the best learnings of all the charities that I've run. And that's essentially what Key for Life's seven step model is. So Nick um, arrived as one of our wonderful mentors. He you know, gave one of our young men, Sean, an opportunity here. My name is Nick Austin, and uh, I've been with Bouygues for 16 years now, since 2005. Um, one of my particular uh, interests and responsibilities is CSR, the Corporate Social Responsibility, and one of my pet CSR projects is Key for Life. It is corporate, but it is personal because you can see somebody and you can you know you can affect them. We can affect the relationships they have, the children that they have. You can affect the generations and it's there for us to do if we have the commitment, if we have the empathy, if we have the will to push it through and to stick with it. Sean came to us on a work taster with, a, with another young lad and he stood out. Um, remarkably, he stood out. He was directing, he was saying, do this, do that. If we do this, if we do that, we can do it. And he was sitting upright and he was interested. He made a big impression on people because he was always polite, um, uh, interested. He was obviously intelligent. There's light in the eyes. My name is Sean Masondel. I started working for Boyd in March of last year for a charity called Key for Life. Um, they're basically a charity that helps young, young men that are at risk of going to prison or already in prison um, sort of find work. Before I started working here, I sort of used to um, float around doing nothing, just sort of aimlessly. Um, coming here has gave me a purpose, generally, I sort of wake up, um, I know I've got something to do every day and um, sort of just everyone likes money at the end of the day, legal, good money. Everyone here is very supportive, um, they've all given me advice that I can apply not only at work but into my personal life as well. Five years ago I thought my life would be in a very um, different place from now, um, albeit a worse place, but it would have been a lot, a lot different, I'd say. It's just good to, to be able to look at something and know that you, you played a part in it. Um, yeah, it's just good to feel part of something. I, I do admire him, I do admire him, because I know how difficult it is for him sometimes, but he still does it, he still turns up. Without realising it, he's learning so much. He's learning the discipline of getting up in the morning. He's learning the discipline of a routine. He's learning the discipline of process, how you must have process. I would hope that we will use him on the next job or on another job. So if things go well, he has a, he has a, he has a good future. Talking to him even today, it's undescribable how far he's come. I'd like to say thank you for giving people a chance. Um, not just people, but anyone that sort of shows they're willing and, and yeah, just willing to put in the hard work.